Hey guys, what's up? This is so many F and Nades and the Flying German. Well, uh, we're doing a dual com right now on a game that I did. Uh, this was pretty wild back. It's uh, me, Sango. That's my name in StarCraft 2 for right now. Uh, versus Mrs. Belvedere over here, spawning at the top right as Protoss. Now, uh, this, I'm still in Bronze League, so you know, I'm pretty much a noob. Uh, me and uh, what's your name on StarCraft 2? Rockuoth. Or is it? No, Logic it? Hack. Logic Remember Hack. I changed it. That's right. Yeah. Uh, I'm formerly a team Logic, uh, so I'm still deciding on what my name should be. So that's why my name's so Songo. Oh wait, how far in are you into the game? I forgot to start it. Uh, I'm at a minute. Uh, okay. Uh, let's try to find it. Uh, yeah. Fuck. He, he yeah. Fails. Now. All right. So uh, uh, I'm spawning down here on the bottom left as Zerg, and uh, well, I used to be a pretty main Protoss. Uh, I believe. That logic hat here is uh, Terran, right? Yeah, Terran. Terran, Probably. yeah. So it's pretty different. Uh, I haven't been playing Zerg. Like I just recently started playing Zerg. Zerg has been is really one really hard races to really play. You know, it's f so macro oriented and everything, and it's so complicated with the larva and everything, and it's just so annoying. But uh, once you really get so used to it, so why do you play it, it really if it's it. annoying? Huh? So why would you play it if it's annoying? Because Zerg are freaking boss. All right, swarming people with your Zerglings and roaches. I mean, who doesn't like that? I know I do. Uh -huh. Now uh -huh. he's going. Uh, Mrs. Belvedere here is going to scout and uh, find me. So I'm still scouting around on the top left. I'm going to be heading towards his base right now. He does have she, he she. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Is it a she? Um, I don't know. I think it's probably a dude that's trying to act like a girl, like you see on Xbox Live when a guy like makes a girl name so that we'll just like call Alex did. We'll just say Belvedere. Belvedere here is getting a double gateway. That could mean many things. He's not getting a Stargate, uh, not Stargate, Cybernetics core yet. Um, so my scout's gonna go in here right now. He's gonna be able to get past this uh, wall in right here. It's not fully finished, and I'm gonna be setting down my hatchery over here. Now, uh. If you guys didn't know, I like to go, uh, I'm a big fan of Spinny Shua, so I like to use his tactics. And no, you just go Mass Roach. Yeah, and then transition straight to Mass Roach. I love it so much. It's so much fun. Uh, uh, as you can see, my scouts. But why would you out. get late gas if you're going for roaches? Huh? Why would you get late uh, late gas like Spinny Shua if you're getting roaches? Well, it's more of like... Uh, it's not that I mostly go mass roaches, it's just kind of I build up on roaches and then maybe eventually take to something else. But usually by the time that I already have mass roaches, it's like they don't have anything and they pretty much lost. So I just get lucked out. But I need to stop, stop using mass roach less because it's really not as effective as you think. Now my hatchery here just finished, so I'm going to be transferring those drones right now and setting down two spine crawlers over here. This is natural defense since I don't even have any zerglings or even a queen. Actually, do I even have a queen on the way? Yeah, I do. Ha I have two queens on the way. Uh, looks like he's going mass zealot for right now, and or it, Belvedere, whatever. I'm just gonna say he. It's a lot easier. Let's just go with it. All right, it. Well, I'm just gonna say he. It's just so much easier. <laughs> uh, I guess it's zealot rushing to me right now. That's <laughs> hate zealot rush, but it's better than stalker and all that stuff. Yeah, like a few days ago, I got freaking zealot cheese, and I got really pissed off. <laughs> I uh, hate going against Protoss. Protoss is really annoying. Me too. I love TVT because I rape them with macro, but you know. But that's only because I'm in Bronze League. Yeah, me too. But hopefully I'll be promoted to Silver soon. Yes, I am. We are newbie, so. We're both super noobs. Yeah. Now I see a Zealot. I'm gonna back out here because Zealots obviously own Zerglings, but uh, he's gonna see those spine crawls and kind of back out. Now let's see. Not much going on in Belvedere's place. Just get massing up, massing up on those zealots. I'm still getting some zerglings. I'm kind of waiting for uh, these zealots to rush in, but I don't want to drag them in too far. Dude, we should be like Korean announcers and make everything and sound exciting. That was a bad misclick by me. With that one, those one set of zerglings, just lost uh, half my zerglings. Jordan, we should make everything totally like amazing, like sound amazing, like Korean. Commentators. Oh, Belvedere going for those gateway. Oh, now he has forge. Oh, forge. Oh my God, he's getting two gas. Oh my God, what are we gonna now do? Now see, as you can see, I've gotten that 
quad gas. All right, I get four gases at the same time at around 44 supply. I just oh my god, he got four gas. Now he's got how many zealots? Uh, eight, and a probe on the way. Probe, what is this? Probably uh, yep, right here. Pylon trying to. Oh, uh, I see, I see. He's he's going for that cannon rush. I hate cannon rush so much. Cannon rush is a real annoying. And as you can see, my zergling, you see my zerglings. I try to stop this, but there's, I mean, those zealots are just so annoying. They just totally destroy my uh, zerglings. I should have taken out that one zealot that's like half dead right there. That was very bad micro by me. Yeah, you're micro. And there, there starts his cannons. His cannons are. Uh, Though luckily his cannons are not in range of my units right now. Maybe my overlords right here. And I see I try to stop it, but there's just too much mass of zealots right now. Oh, if you guys you guys should see the video I put up where there was a guy who tried to cannon rush me and he was completely retarded. <sighs> cannon rushers. He's got three cannons on the way. And I am in fact getting my baneling nest right now. I see this you and react with my bane lanes because my roaches can't. Wait, I have a roach wall right now, but my roaches won't be able to do much. You should have focused down that. I feel like you should have focused down that pylon. Though. Yeah, I probably should have, but there's. I think there's too much of a massive zealots to even be able to deal with that because zealots massively destroy zerglings. Oh yeah, yeah, but you had it down to like 60 health. Yeah. And I think I, uh, not much going on though in Mrs. Belvedere. So obviously, he's going like just straight up cannon rushing, trying to push me all the way back in my uh, main, so I don't, you know, expand. So I can't expand. I can't mass up too much on a big army because I don't have much space. Can't spread creep or anything. So he's really blocking me off here right now with these cannons. But luckily, his cannons are not in position to be able to attack me. So that's a good thing. Uh, Luckily, this guy is so retarded that he's not getting anything, and he only, he's sitting on two gateways. Six. No gas. He's sitting on six. He has six uh, One four. cans right now. Two on. Now, he's finally just now getting his cybernetic score. So, at the 10 minute mark, cybernetic score is uh, pretty late, I would have to say. Yeah. Plus, it, on one base, he has over 700 minerals saved up. Yeah. So. Seriously? I feel like you should have built more zealots or something, or brought out some stalkers in, in case you rape his As you can rush. see, he's getting those two gateways and just starting on both of his gases. And not really actually going out for many probes. He doesn't have a very fully saturated uh, mineral line. And he hasn't even tried to expand yet. So, uh, I don't know what he's yeah, doing he, right now. Yeah, he only has half of the amount of probes that you need to actually saturate a mineral line, so that's kind of a yeah, problem. Yeah, I don't know these... I don't know these, uh, hold on, let's see. Let's see APM. My APM is 49 average. His is 34. Ooh, I have a higher APM. I feel accomplished. Yeah. Now, these roaches are going to try to focus fire on this uh, pylon here, but these cannons are just so annoying. He eventually has to end up canceling, so that's good for me. But he's just going to put a pylon right behind it. I, I can't do anything about that. He may have you, have you contained, but I think you're pretty much raping him economy wise. Economy wise, I am, because I have almost double his, uh, drones uh, I have almost double drones and he has probes but unfortunately my natural really isn't saturated and uh, I think I should have worked better on to get drones but I really need to size up a small amount of army so I can take out this defense because right now he has seven uh, cannons with two more on the way but one of them is almost half dead so oh wait no no it's not yeah no mind yeah, I did place down another spine crawler, and uh, yeah, see his arm, uh, his work for his army force and his workforce are very low. As you can see, he's only got ten zealots, ten zealots. That's it. I've got thirteen roaches, uh, only three zerglings though. But I mean, I have more roaches than he has zealots, and I have way yeah, more drones than he has probes. Ooh, major lag. He's just getting his uh, his warp gate tech, which is pretty surprising. Even I, as a Terran player who sexes Protoss, knows to get that. Oh, talking to his mom. Bad interruption right there. I will have to place blame that on my uh, Asian mother making bread. Yeah. 
But as you can see, he's just getting his warp gate tech if you look down the production tab, which is pretty yeah, sad. Yeah, it's, it's really bad that he only he hasn't, I mean, he just hasn't built up a workforce at all or any sizable army. He's just building up on these cannons trying to take me down. And he had to cancel that uh, cannon right there. He's trying to put it at to a point where it can reach my gas so I won't have uh, much gas. But as you can see, I have, I'm sitting on 3,000 gas. And yeah. But the thing is, if he had built up, uh, spent those minerals that he has extra on some units, then if you even if you broke this contain, it would be no problem for him, and he would and just crush. And the problem with him is he's not fully paying attention to his base too. I mean, he just chrono boosted again. He needs to stay up on that chrono boost. He also needs to expand. He's sitting on eleven thousand. I only have twenty something uh, minerals, and he's sitting on eleven yeah. hundred. And he could easily expand. You know, get some new better units. You know, maybe tech to void rays. I mean, tech to something. DTs maybe to sneak in and try and hit me because. Uh, uh, I mean, I finally got my lair and working on some uh, ventral sacks. I'm finally getting the ventral sacks, so I've got banelings on the way now. So I finally had these banelings. Yeah. You know what you could have done is actually, like, uh, getting the ventral sacks and then getting overlord speed and dropping into his main base and just completely fuck mm -hmm. him. I think that would have been <laughs> interesting. But we'll see what happens. We'll see. Yeah, see, he finally put that cannon right in the place where he can easily attack my extractor. There's nothing I can do, honestly. There's really nothing I can do. He has too many cannons for me to be able to deflect. So I'll have to pull those drones off and put them back onto the mineral line. Yeah, but you can see, even in the supply, you're way ahead. Yeah, I know. I have almost double his supply. Is... And he's just putting those... This is one of the worst executions of a photon cannon rush that I've ever yeah. seen. No, I but mean, honestly, I've seen many, but like, and those, that was bad, very bad placement of warping. He's easy in my spine call. But, yeah. uh, honestly though, his defense is, is decent. Like, it is, he was smart enough to get that cannons in, but he was He's not smart enough where what he should have done is taken out my spine crawlers and placed the pylon directly and then try to place as many photon cannons. I think he might not be able to do that. Like, see, now he's trying to focus fire on my spine crawler. See, there you go. He's doing that right now. But I guess maybe he can't do that just because uh, he can't place anything on my creep. So that really takes away from his uh, ability to use his photon cannons. But those pho uh, photon cannons really push me back so I can't move out and try and uh, force him. But I am, uh, you can see that I'm poking at these zealots. That zealot only has 8 HP. Wow, lucky bastard. Hey, just wondering, what is pneumat pneumatized carapace? What is what? I don't know. Pneumatized carapace or pneumatized. I don't know. It's P-N-E-U-M-A-T-I-Z-E-D carapace. That? I don't know. What are you talking about? I don't know. It's an upgrade you were getting. An upgrade I was getting? Yeah, it's called Pneumatized Carapace. Oh, uh, oh it's probably uh, speed. Uh, uh, speed. Now, see, I do have all these Banely set up. Now, I am going to do what Logic was talking about. I'm going to take these Overlords. I might <laughs> may lose a couple Overlords, uh, full of them, but I'm also going to take these Banely and just drop them all over his army and all over his Photon Cannons. This I did learn from the MLG game. I did learn this from the MLG game. And I am very proud of it. <laughs> and see how fast these uh, these pylons, these photon cannons are just going. They, they, I mean, they, he can't do anything about it. All his cannons are just gone. Just gone. Totally gone. And his army is, is just totally destroyed. Wow, I must be way behind you. Why? Oh, cause you were talking about <laughs> you were talking about dropping the banelings, and I was like way behind, like five. And minutes. now you can see that my banelings are finally attacking the rest of his photon cannons. I mean, there's just nothing you can do. He has a very small army. My my supply now is double his, and I might as well just go ahead and move out with my roaches, even though if it's a small amount, and I can get these roaches to for backup, and just. 
he has nothing left. And, and as you can see at his base, he's got nothing but four warp gates. That's all he has, four warp gates. And I'm going to come in with these roaches and just go ahead and clean all this up. Yeah, and I didn't I didn't even see him warping anything in. He's Wow, he, he even tried to make more photon cannons. And there's nothing he can really do at this point. This guy. I mean, I'm destroying all his pylons. He's not going to have any supply. I mean, uh... After this, what is he gonna do? If I move in right now with this small amount, there's nothing he can do. He's only got four warp gates. He can maybe block off for like like a couple seconds, and then I'm in. And his probes are gone. He hasn't even hasn't even expanded. And I've about supply blocked him. And there's the GG. Well, that was a. Uh, I like this game. I mean, it was pretty fun for me. And you know what's pretty funny? Yeah. Uh, I actually played Mrs. Belvedere again today. Yeah, and I beat him. You did? Maybe I'll post that game wow, up too. Nice. Did he recognize you? I don't know. You? He said the same so. thing. GG WP. Well played. I mean, he ha he's got some good manners though. Yeah. I admit, some people online, you know, I hate it. They don't have any good manners. But um, yeah, I really think uh, Mrs. Belvedere could have learned better from this. You know, maybe not. Maybe rush a little bit forward with this photon cannons. Build his base up. Expand a couple times. He is sitting on 800 minerals. I mean, my supply was almost like triple his. <laughs> did he cannon rush no, you again? No, he didn't. He actually, uh, not much happened. But the funny thing is in that game, uh, well, maybe I'll post it up. But, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this was a dual com with me and, well, his name right now on StarCraft 2 is Logic Hack. I don't know. Is that, are you going to change anything, like, with your, uh, web, uh, your YouTube channel or anything? Probably not. I'll just do what Wings of Redemption does and have a different YouTube name right. for my gamer tag. Well, from I'm gonna post tag. his uh, YouTube channel on the below, so uh, go to that, check out some of his videos. He's got some pretty good uh, StarCraft games, so uh, check those out. And uh, well, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, rate, everything. Do whatever you want. I don't even if it's you know a dislike. I don't care. Just do something. Get some views for me. All right, and I'll see you guys next time.